Hey guys, Jeff here with Fat Kids Barbecue. So today we got our new pit barrel smoker in. So I placed an order for this on Tuesday and today's Thursday. Took two days to get here. So pretty exciting. We're gonna smoke this weekend. We're gonna do some oxtail on this. We're gonna probably do some uh, steak tips for dinner on here tonight. And then we're gonna also do um, Oh, I don't know, maybe some ribs over the weekend. We're going to try this puppy out. So anyhow, you can see this arrived in pretty good shape. The box kind of got beat up just a little bit, as you can see down there. So hopefully everything inside is all right. Um, we're going to do a little demo. I've never set one of these things up. So we're going to open it up and uh, see what it takes to set this thing up. So, ah, kind of cool. I got a nice little thank you note on the box. That's pretty nice of them to put in there. When you open this up, I guess you have, they sent you some, some good rubs. We've got a beef and game pit rub and an all purpose pit rub. So that should be pretty good. And then they give you uh, a coupon to get another 10% off on buying more stuff. So we'll, we'll have to look into that. We'll save that over there. We got a little sticker, I guess. And then our, our packing slip that tells all the good stuff we got. So we got the Federal Agency's Classic Barrel Cooker, the PBC package. Ah, I think they sent me the wrong one. They sent me the Border Patrol one. And I didn't order a Border Patrol one. So we'll have to see, but that's okay. Uh, we got the chimney starter, the cover, the hinges, an ash pan, pit grips, turkey hanger, sausage hanger, a corn basket, and a phone call. So we'll have to decline that and call that back. And then we got uh, 10 inch skewers, an ultimate hook tool, and a bottle opener. All right, so in our box, we have our lid. I guess it comes pre-drilled for your horseshoe handle. So we'll lay this guy down. Oh. One horseshoe handle and eight hooks. This must be our stand. That it is. This is our grill how oh, good it comes with one of those other grills so you can access it and put put more stuff inside so when you need to fill more charcoal and such so as you can tell they do a pretty good job of packaging this is the attachable ash pan. I had to pay additional for this. You would think they would provide an ash pan with it. Kind of disappointing that I did have to pay more just to have the ash pan. But from everything I saw online, this is worth it. Here's all of these fun boxes that the cover so there's all kinds of goodness in here as you can see they kind of just threw everything right down in the box so kind of just scattered in there but nothing appears to be broken so that's good Well, these are all these different hooks, hanging skewers, a turkey hanger, 
Guess I now have to do a turkey. That's all right. This looks like it must be for corn on the cob. Yep, it is. Then we have the ultimate hook tool and a bottle opener. Sausage holder, hot dog holder. This charcoal lighter, I guess it's really good. Never used one, but we'll try this out today. You know, outside of everything just being kind of thrown on the inside of it, the packaging here is pretty good. So we'll, we'll get this out of there. Oh, we got one more thing down in there. Oh, another side mount bottle opener. And this must be the uh, basket for the coal. So we'll set that to the side. And we'll lift this guy right out of the packet. Oh, nope, they, they did send me the right one. I ordered the one with the American flag on it. So it didn't show that it's the right one, but this is the correct one. Oh, and here's our, our rebar. I guess this is what goes across to hang all your stuff on. So that's pretty good. So this looks like a... Real simple uh, assembly here. So everything looks pretty good. Everything came together. We're in the garage because it's 92 degrees outside. And I didn't want to necessarily stand outside and do this. So there it goes. So that's really simple. So we're going to finish assembling this, then we'll move it outside to the garage. It's just a matter of putting stuff in place, I guess, now. All right, so we got this pit barrel smoker all assembled. A um, couple of things. It took only a couple of minutes to put it together, so it is a real easy assembly. You know, one thing I might have done is this handle's kind of not as you can see it's not really in the center of the lid so when you pick it up it is kind of awkward and makes the, the lid get a little bit flimsy on you the cool thing is there is a hook so you can hang it on the side of your barrel just like you see there you know all in all it looks pretty nice the quality of the barrel is pretty good um, 